great against LSU. Did you feel like you had something to prove to him and to everyone else today? Oh, yeah, a lot because this this team is pushed by me. He tell me every game, you got to play great for us to be, go out and do great things. So I just got to come out and do a better game by game to lead this team to victory. Offensively, Darren, and yourself included, I mean, it seemed like a little bit of rust last week. Did this performance today have more to do with you guys shaking off the rust, or was it Nevada maybe not just up to your level? Better defense. First week, we had a better defense. We got to go out and compete at a high level the first game. Uh, the fact that you did get a six touchdowns today, I mean, uh, how are you feeling uh, throughout the game uh, as it was going on? Did you just feel like you were in the zone, or? I really didn't know I had six, but uh, I mean, I was just playing game, play to play, just like we always play. Going back to all my practice rules and everything I had practice and prepare for this whole week and just went out, did great things. I'm happy for all the receivers. And uh, just talk a bit about uh, DeAnthony and the game he had today. Oh, yeah, we expect him to do things like that. That's the expectation that we hold for DeAnthony because he's a hardworking guy and he, he does great things. He's been doing great things since he got here. So it's just a step in the right direction. Six touchdown passes, a lot. you threw the ball there, but a lot of times the guys were wide open. Can you talk about the, the weapons that you have, specifically D'Anthony, Vaughn caught a touchdown today, you know, D'Anthony on that screen, the weapons that you have? Oh, yeah, like I was saying, them guys did a great job. Great whole week of emphasizing every little small detail that they messed up on last week, and they want to come out this week and show y'all that they was cleaning it up. What do you feel like when you see one of those guys wide open down there? Oh, I'm very confident in them guys making the big play. I just got to get the ball in their hands. That's what I feel. Darren, how much did this team need a win like this after last week? Uh, we really needed it, but we still got a lot to go. We're not happy. We're not happy just because we got a win today. We still, we're not upset about the last week's win, but we still had that in the back of our head. So we came out this week working harder, and we, hopefully we continue this and don't, don't need a loss to amp us up. Darren, Chip said he didn't want to see guys patting themselves on the back on Monday. With Missouri State coming in after a team like after you whip on Nevada, is that going to be the challenge this week to just sort of uh, go back and grind and get ready, regardless of who you're playing? Yeah, like I was saying, this is not a, it's just not about Missouri State. It's about just going out, doing our thing, making sure we stay clean on the offensive side. It's going to be a big challenge for us to come out and do the same thing because, like you said, this is not a good team to go into next week, but we still got to come out with that same fire like we play in LSU. Did you guys need a blowout not only for yourself, but maybe for the rest of the country watching to see what you guys were going to do coming back after what happened last week against LSU? Oh, yeah. I know everybody was waiting for us to bounce back because they wanted to see what type of team we had. They thought that was our, that was our team that we had out there last week. But we had to show guys that we, we're coming out this year hard and ready to go. Darren, which of your touchdown passes are you most proud of? I'm just glad that everybody caught the ball and I got it to all the guys. I missed a couple of touchdown passes that I maybe could have hit at the end of the game. So, I mean, just got to get better. I ain't really too worried about the amount of, amount of touchdowns I had today. Just want to improve and get better each week. You got, you got drilled. At the, uh, you stood in and took a real pop on a throw. I think the Anthony caught in the corner of the end zone. How does that one rate in your passes today? That looked like a that looked like a true quarterback standing in the pocket and taking a shot. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. A lot of them is like that. Just sitting in the pocket. That's the ones I like. Getting up off the ground and the guys making a big play. Darren, you also